and welcome back or to Katie Dance. So hi guys, hello. This morning, um, <laughs> this morning I'm going to be doing the second vlog for London. Um, so yeah, as you guys can see, I'm at breakfast. Well, you can't see that, but we're at breakfast. We just finished in Premier Inn. Uh, um, I got my London England top that I bought yesterday, which I actually didn't show you guys, so I'll have to show you what I got, but I got this jumper, so I'm wearing that. I'm going to look like a complete tourist, but it's fine. I also got some free lollies from the um, hotel. So yeah, now we're going to go back up. I'm not got one too. <laughs> They're laughing at me doing this. I was literally sitting here. And I don't want to be in it. I don't want to be in it. I don't want to be in it. So now we're going to go up to the room and get sorted. Today we're going to the Tower of London and then tonight we're going to see Hamilton. <laughs> Darren's also. So guys, we are now out of the hotel and we're heading down to the tube station to go to, what is the Tower of London? Tower of London. And yeah, that is where the Queen's crown is kept. So we're going to go to all the crown jewels. just came out of the tour of London and it was really good we got a little tour at the end which was very informative and interesting um, and we got a lot of history like um, in with the fun side of it and they're all about the executions and the torture and it was really fun so now we're walking to uh, go to the tube station again and get the tube to Camden Market where we're going to a little market to see if there's any more crystals and also like some little Facts and things, yeah. So, yeah. As you saw, the Camden Market was really cute and it had like loads of different stalls and everything in it and it was really fun just to walk around and I also got some things and I'll show you guys something. First things that I got were some crystals because um, that was the main place that I wanted to go for crystals. So I went to a shop called Quena, 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 something like that and it was in like the indoor part. I couldn't find it for ages but then we finally got to it. So I'm going to give you guys a little haul. So this is some raw blue calcite that I got. I think this one was really pretty because it's got like all the little um, indentation, but you can see it's been like growing, growing right now. So. And then I also got, there was like this little deal. It was like pick three, get the price of one other one or something like that. But I got some carnelian, which is really pretty. I thought this one was really nice. Um, I just kind of pick the one that like kind of gives me vibes. And then, and then I got some polished blue calcite. I think this one's really nice because you can like set it up like this. And then I also got um, some black obsidian. I actually don't have any black obsidian before this. So that was my first piece. Most of these are, no. Most of these are ones that I've never had before. The only one that I do, the only two that I don't, uh, that I do have, um, I've got um, this raw rose quartz. 
um, and this was like really good. And they also had a deal for this, like get three for like five pounds, but I just decided to get this one. And then I also got a raw chunk of Amazonite. This one was really nice. I like the color on it, especially, and also like the raw pieces. And it was like all sparkly on the back, as you guys can see. And then last but not least, I got this selenite cleansing stick. This is selenite or satin score, whatever way you want to say it. But this was really good because it was only about 2.50 and it was um, a quite large chunk of it. But I got all my crystals and the, um, do you want me to show you Man United top? Matt, you got a Man United top as well. Um, but I also got this. I was so happy with this. I Guys, I cannot believe like how... Oh, it's a fake, it's obviously fake, it's not real, but it's a fake Chanel bag and it looks so real, like it looks so, like, real, like I just couldn't believe when I found it and it's really nice and I'm gonna um, wear it to Hamilton and dinner later too. Um, you wear a bag? Do you get that, wearing a bag? You can carry it, wear it, whatever. But yeah, I'm going to carry it to Hamilton, I guess. That sounds weird. <laughs> so, hi guys. I'm all changed. I'm wearing this top with little flowers. And I'm also wearing my checkered black and white with my Converse and tights. And I've got my new bag as well. So pretty. Um, and we're going to go to dinner in a place called Pizza Pilgrim. Is it? Mm-hmm. So, yeah. dinner and now we're gonna head over to the theater to see how much So we just got out and it was really good. I think I'm gonna do two vlogs in one because this vlog was quite short today. So I'm gonna do day two and day three and it'll be uploaded on Friday morning. Yes, Friday morning, hopefully. So yeah, if this is uploaded then, good job to me because I don't think it'll be uploaded by then. Yeah, Hamilton was just brilliant. The cast was really good and everyone was great. And it was really fun because I've always wanted to see it live. So hi guys, so it is now the next morning. It is Thursday morning. And we've had our breakfast and I'm all ready. I'm gonna do my little outfit for you guys too. So <laughs> this is my outfit. So I've got this little cropped white jumper on. Mom thinks this is weird because it's mixing winter and spring apparently and summer. And then I've got these trousers on. They're from Primark too. And then I've got my bag that I got yesterday. Gorgeous, it's my new favorite thing. And that is it. I also, oh, this is nice. This is like the light. Um, I also had a shower this morning, so my hair is like actually kind of dry now because it's been like an hour or so. Um, so to this morning we're going to St Paul's to have a walk around in like a, is it a square? Cathedral. <laughs> St Paul's. Yes, I know what I'm talking about now. St Paul's Cathedral, and then we're going to the Tower Bridge experience london tour london bridge experience oh my gosh i'm so bad but yeah um it's like kind of like the london dungeon but not like
guys, I'm actually in the bathroom right now um, because we couldn't find anywhere else to go. But it's really cute in here. It has like the little restaurant, which is why I just got away. That's just saw. Um, I can't remember what it's called, but it's like really cool. Um, it's looks really nice. But we are about to go in a few minutes to the London Britney experience. I'm kind of scared because it is like one of those scary ones, like the London Dungeon. And apparently, I'm a child when I was younger and I wouldn't go to the scary bit because I like freaked out. And I was only eight years old though when I came here. And I was like, I'm keeping on it and I kind of got very scared so I'm hoping that I don't get scared this time I'll be fine because I've been the only person and it wasn't that bad so yeah I will hopefully try and do a few things for you guys but let's go be scared Starbucks right now, I'm literally in Starbucks and I got a forget me not opportunity that I got a little cake cup that is really cute. So we're seeing this a lot. Mm. It's creamy like orange with vanilla and it's really nice. But we went to the London Bridge experience and it was really scary. Literally I was like screaming the whole time. But it was really good and I love going to like the horror attractions when he comes at some point. So yeah, now we're going to Primark in Oxford Street. Guys, as you saw, we are now in Nando's and we got a nice lunch. We're all done, and I'm gonna sneeze. And so you saw like the huge lunch shop. It was literally like two floors, like so big. It had like a coffee saving area and everything. Um, and I got some stuff from there. I also got some stuff from H and M. And in Starbucks, I got to keep a reusable cup. Like how cute is that? I think I showed you guys that. But I'm like. I'm happy with that because I always went to the, the Starbucks cup. And then I also went to the big curry mark and one of the things that I got were these little nails that also match my outfit that I'm going to be wearing to another show that we're going to tonight. Um, Cinderella, me and my mum are just going. So um, that's going to match and I'm going to show you guys that later. So yeah, now we're ready to go back to the hotel just to like reconvene the hotel, you know. So let's go. So guys, I'm going to give you a little haul of what I got from H&M, Primark and Lush. So here we go. So I only got one thing in H&M, which was this little light blue top with the little frilly kind of sleeves, like puffed sleeves. Um, I think it's really nice. And I also got it to go with like a little skirt that I have that I bought from Primark last year. Um, that I do have a t-shirt that goes with it, but I thought like a more dressy top would be nice. So that was the first thing. Then I also got, this is moving on to Primark. Um, first of all, I'm actually just gonna do these. Um, I got my nails, which you guys saw that I put on. These ones are really nice and hopefully they'll go with my outfit um, today. These were at two pounds. Then these ones were 250. These are the marbled purple, gold and white ones. Um, I think these are also really nice. I got both of these because they both went outfit with outfits that I was gonna pick to go, but I'm just gonna um, put the ones that match with these. And then I also got this little wallet with a K on it. Um, this was about three points. It was really cheap. And I wanted a new wallet because the one that I had at the moment was this yellow one that I got like a couple of years ago um, for when I went into secondary school. But this one um, matches my new bag well too. And 
it's just nice and spacious and big and it has room for all of my cards and stuff and then I got some sunglasses I definitely need some new sunglasses so I thought these would be really nice they're like this periwinkle corn floor blue it's kind of nice because they're like see-through and then I also um, really like the kind of purpley tinge to the glasses and the gold on the rims or on the legs of the glasses then I also got this little top. I have this with me that I'm gonna wear tonight in pink, but this is just a plain white one. Um, I thought it would go really well with this skirt that I'm about to show you, um, and just anything, just like a little vest top to put underneath cardigans or anything like that. I also love these because the straps are all biodegradable and everything, and so are the tops. We're like recyclable or made from recycled material. Then I have this little skirt. It's like this satiny, flowy kind of type material with little daisies on it and it's purple with little ties at the side and like a little um, cut at the bottom. And I think this is really nice. It's also got a zip, which I always like in skirts. And then I got two little bath bombs. Um, not two bath bombs, but two things from Lush. They had a huge, huge shop, which I filmed for you guys. Um, that is actually crazy. I could spend hours in there but I'm just gonna show you what I got. Okay, so the first one that I got was a bath bomb. This is the Blackberry bath bomb. And I love this new cut that the bath bombs have on the bottom because it makes it easier for them to stand rather than them being fully circular. I like the mold and everything because it's very um, blackberry. I think it was blackberry or blueberry or something like that. Um, and then the next one that I got was, I. I think I actually can't, I think this is called the bright side and um, this is a bubble bar though and I thought this swirling was just really unique and clean on this one and it smells like citrus and orange and lemon and bergamot okay so that is my little haul done and now I'm going to put all of these away and also tidy up my clothes over there from yesterday too and also try and edit a bit of this video for um or before we go out to Cinderella so nice. Um, I am just about to head out. I just want to give you a little outfit check actually before we go. So I wore my pink top. This is from Primark. This is from Primark. This is from Primark. These are from Primark. Converse. Um, ring. Nails from Primark. That is it. Necklace. I've got a little dragonfly. Um, and that's it, I'm taking my handbag, um, my Chanel one, and then we're going. really bad here but we just got out and we're walking back to the hotel right now but Cinderella was really good and I like it surprised me a lot I didn't know many of the songs um, and I just thought it was really good for like the stage moved guys like it flipped sorry there's there's like large motorbike stage but the whole stage like turned around like in the um, theater it was Really, like I was like whoa and like even stayed there for like a little bit it was so good and I really enjoyed it and it was a really good night out so yeah I am going to have to end this here because we're trying to find our way back and this video is probably way too long anyway so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you all very soon hopefully bye